very effective core workout is what's called the 100s, and there are four options depend on your level, your ability to perform these. So you want to lie back. I'm going to show, I'm going to show your options first. You want to keep your head, your feet to the side, your head on the ground. Option one is your feet planted on the ground and your knees bent. Option two is you can lift your feet off the ground but keep your knees bent. Option three are your legs straight, straight up to the to the sky, or your legs straight but at an angle. The lower that angle, the more difficult. So option one is easiest. Option two is a little more difficult. Option three adds a little more difficulty. Option four adds the greatest amount of difficulty. And what you want to do, depending on what option you use, is you're going to draw in your navel, keep your back at the neutral position, and lift your head off the ground, but raising up with your with your abdominals, not just with your neck, but with your abdominals. So I'm going to show all four options. You just want to have your hands to your side and just go up and down 100 times. Hence the reason why this exercise is called 100s. So this is option one. This is option two. This is option three. And this is option four. And again, this is the most difficult option. While doing the 100s, if your neck becomes tired, you can always lie it back. That just means you're not drawing in your navel as much, or you can try and reach forward more. So again, you want to raise your arms up and down 100 times. Option one, option two, add a little more difficulty, option three, and option four. If your neck gets tired, just lie it back and then raise back up, drawing in that navel until you get to 100, and then you're done.